what's going on in here? Oh, are we getting a ghost concert? No. No, it's just Bumblebee going for the drums. Um, I don't know. Bert isn't very happy. Needs to get some breakfast in him. Boiled cereal in the fridge. Someone should clean it out. I mean, I don't want to. I'm, I'm lazy. So it won't be me. One of the Sims should. All these kids want to own more properties. I think I have no choice but to completely spoil them and have their dad go out and buy a load of buildings. It's hilarious though, in real life kids are like, I don't know, I want a bike, I want a PlayStation. In in here, the, in The Sims, they're just like, I want a building downtown. Come on, Bumblebee. Time to go buy some buildings. I like that we still don't get bills. That's weird, Bumblebee just flying through the air. Parking his limo across an intersection to get out. It's probably smart for me to buy these places because um, it's a good source of income. brought out other partners he'd get more money get greater control he can pick, apparently pick up his money weekly by going there where's the other property they own because there must be loads of money there I'm pretty sure they own the beach but I never get um, money to collect from there Is the beach we bought, isn't it? There's probably some property somewhere in town with a load of money just waiting for me. And I've just never picked it up. Or else that's an out of date message and I automatically get the money these days. It's hard to tell, The Sims. The Berts are having a birthday tomorrow. Well, tomorrow at midnight. Um, oh, that doesn't even count as owning the properties. Oh, it's own three venues. Oh. Okay. Um, what are the other ones? Oh, there is a real estate option. Um, a lot value. Oh, right, I can upgrade these venues. I never knew that. Where are the other venues? Little Corsican Bistro, is that one? No. Bookshop. Pretty sure that place was one, but I can't buy it. Um, oh, I don't think this matters too much. It'd be nice to get those points, though. Is that one? No. No. Oh well, I'll figure it out later. Oh, 
kids are off for school. They're not all clean. They're going to be the smelly kids. And this baby is being a little bit neglected. Oh, I think she's stuck. Yeah, Hillary seems to be stuck. I'll just have to reset her. Has that worked? Yeah, fixed. Perfect. Oh, that kid's going to wet herself any minute now. Guaranteed, as soon as she's put to bed. What's Bentley doing? Ah! I know it's his lifelong dream to drum or something, but... Oh, he can't. He's not allowed. in such a bad mood how oh, the place is smelly actually someone she should probably clean out the bad food oh she's smelly not the house okay then boys causing trouble at the police station close to his lifetime wish. He wants to meet a vampire. His wife and three three of his kids are vampires. The fourth one might be. I, To be honest, I'm not sure why he wants to meet another one. I think meeting a non-vampire would be more sort of special for him. At least he wants to see all his kids age up well. He doesn't have a favourite. I have a, a favourite. Little Bert is my favourite. With Bert with a U. The disciplined computer whiz. He's clumsy as well. It, but we can live with that. Bort is kind of good as well. He has cool hair. But hair changes when Sims grow up. And they can always go to the barbers. You know, and change it to something else. Or just even look in a mirror and change it to something else. Better do all their homework. Uh, I'll get it done in a couple of seconds anyway. Bort has the right idea. Just do it on the floor. Then you don't have to worry about finding a free chair. What skill should Bort learn next? Ooh, he's got painting, he's got logic, he's got inventing. I don't think kids can do mixology, unfortunately. That would be a nice one to get him. Uh, cooking. Can he do cooking? Let's have him bake some blueberry muffins and find out. Other kids need a bath. They're pretty smelly. Oh, I locked up that house, of course. Um, okay, I'll let little Bort in on his own. Just to bake vanilla muffins. No, cooking seems to progress normal speed. How about riding? Oh, no. Dudley's stuck outside the gate. Where does this one 
to sleep. I forget whose bed is whose. Bert with a U sleeps up here. That's as, that's how much I know. Uh, what skills could he learn? Oh, he doesn't have inventing yet. These are like evil little genius kids. I, I, it's got to be hard moving some of them out because they work so well as like in their little lab as like a team of child villains. Masters of inventing, among other things, inventing and chemistry and painting. What other skills can a kid learn? Um, I don't even know what other skills there are. They can't do martial arts until they're teens, which is a shame. Oh, there's the winemaking skill as well. I've completely ignored that so far. Better look after this kid before going to bed. Little Bert. you think all the Berts would be more confusing than it is, but I don't think so. What is a bit weird is that the bald Berts got reversed when they aged to child. Like the one that was bald got hair and the one that had hair went bald. So <laughs> that um, threw me a little. Oh, Bentley's up. I presumed he'd be in bed by now. It's like pretty late. Might as well have some of that ghost pie. And finish his book. Oh no. Oh. He's bad at living in a haunted house. What I like is that he faints and then wakes up to turn off the stereo because it's waking him up from fainting. Let's continue writing this. I kind of hope that Bert turns into, as in girl Bert, turns out to be a really good sim. So I can kind of keep her on as the heir and let the three boys like live together in what I imagine would be like a sitcom life in some house somewhere where, you know, they work together on scams. It would be awesome. Oh, Bentley Schmooze finished his lifetime wish. Oh, wow. 948 a week for his latest book. That's pretty good. He's a pretty awesome writer now. Um, level 5 in his career. see what he can write next. I know there's other categories he can unlock, I'm just not sure how he does it. Um, oh, 
he has romance available. I didn't realize that. Let's write a romance novel. We'll call it, um, what'll we call it? Fumble Barn with an exclamation mark. It's about rolling about in the hay with someone you love. God, needy children. Well, babies. The kids have been up for ages and are all like ready for school. <laughs> Bort wants to become a partner at several businesses. Oh, all of them do. I, c I think I can do that. Alright, okay, Bumblebee should just go buy a part of... Oh, what can we get a cut of? A thrift store? Damn. No. The stadium. Oh, it's that Bert's birthday. This is confusing, actually. <laughs> I was completely lost when I saw that message. Hey, while he's out, he should buy a couple more venues. Um, I don't know how we buy them, though. It's fine. Just go home. Okay, they're all going to school. So, I'll have Bert's birthday now. Um, toddlers never touched their floor food. It's full of marrow bone jelly in chunks. I don't know, like it's perfectly nutritious. What I miss from The Sims 2 is the little sort of movie sequences that would happen for big events, like birthdays and childbirth and everything. They were really cool. I love the alien one, where the alien baby just sort of flies in. Hooray! Bert is a toddler. Not a happy toddler. First thing she does is cry. Is she a vampire? Yeah, she's a vampire too. Oh well. Uh, someone should look after her for a while. You. Um, teach her to talk. That's a pretty important one. He should be writing his novel. Poor Dudley. Nobody's paying attention to him anymore. He'll be old quite soon. Well, soon on a unicorn scale. Oh, these guys should be meeting new friends, actually. They probably make up the entirety of the school kid population, but I need to scope out potential girlfriends for them. That's how things work in The Sims. <laughs> 